Mateo, RJ Hampshire, uh, Glendale, first wins to Sanaheim 1. And really, once you got out front, like a strong, commanding ride, like that wasn't just a win, that was a statement. Yeah, yeah, I needed I needed one like that. Um, and I felt like A1, man, I was so solid and just had a lot more speed than everybody else. Uh, then today I came and I had that case and first time qualifying and dude, I, I was hurting bad like after that. Dude, my jaw was over to the right. I had to have G get my jaw back in and then my lower back. So it's like, all right, this is uh, reminding me too much of like my years past, like just it's going to be a grind tonight. Um, but yeah, I just, I got a decent start, made some quick passes and then yeah, once I got out front, man, I was like, all right, just click them off. Like, it's the best I rode kind of all day was that main event. We made some good changes for the, the from the heat to the main, and yeah, I was, I was stoked on that. So did you hit your jaw on the bars then, I guess, when you cased whatever you did? Yeah, yeah, I caught that tough block off the double jumping over the start uh, and came up so short. When I did, dude, I smacked my jaw on the dang bar pad. So that moved over, and like, I, dude, I could barely open my mouth when I came back. Yeah. And then, like, dude, just the hit I took off of that, like, dude, my back was smoked. So, like, yeah, I knew it was going to be a long day and uh, just kind of put everything I had into that main event, which, yeah, was solid. Uh, you say you made changes before the main event. What were they? Let's go deep. Um, honestly, Hunter, our, our suspension guy, he'll, he's really good at being able to watch and then just kind of be like, hey, look, if we do this, it'll help you know, later on or, or whenever. Uh, I think he sped up my uh, uh, rear a little bit. We softened my forks because um, that's kind of what we felt like is my for my front, like if you watch in the heat race for sure, like my front was everywhere. Like I felt like I had no feel for it. Uh, so all we did was so soften it up a bit um, for the main event. And yeah, actually I felt like I had more front front traction and um, man, I, I kind of wish we had some bigger whoops, like not gonna lie, like those whoops are just, send and pray like dude it's, it's it bumps me out i mean there's been i've been so many years where i'm terrified of them and i don't even want to hit them because they build them so big and then now it's like look i i want to hit big whoops and then now they're building these things where i mean yeah it's part of i i can't complain dude i yeah just one tonight but uh yeah it just bumps me out because i feel like that's more my strength right now and uh yeah it's all good though on uh, lap one when you were behind the two big hitters, uh, what was your mindset? Were you panicking and feeling like you needed to make a move quick or were you happy enough to sit behind and let the race come to you? Yeah, that was the plan really. Uh, Murph, before I went out, it's like, look, put pressure on them. That's all it's going to take. And uh, I don't know if you noticed, but I didn't three on to that tabletop all day. You know, not even heat race, yeah. nothing. Uh, main event came, lap two, they did it right in front of me. And I said, well, we want to win this, we're going to hit this. So I threed on off and I just stuck to that, you know, the rest of the main. Um, yeah, I wasn't I wasn't freaking out just because like, I, I knew how I felt. Uh, I was more worried about how, how I was going to be on my bike, really, like if I had that comfort or not and, and can push. Um, but, man, the track was challenging tonight. Like, dude, steep, long rhythms, um, slick, really slick. Uh, yeah, it's a fun day, though. Man, I can't complain. Uh, last thing, four points down now, five points down. Uh, nice place to be. It's a little gap, but really, it's not anything that's going to hold you back. Yeah, yeah, I'm stoked on that, man. Like, uh, yeah, I don't know the points difference, but maybe if I didn't throw away that third at San Diego, we'd be in a different situation right now. But I'm not going to kind of look back on that, just kind of look forward, focus on myself. I had two good weekends back to back, you know, Anaheim two, solid points tonight, solid points. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna hop on a 450 here for a little bit. I'm gonna go home, spend some time on it. Um, gonna race it? I don't know, probably not, but uh, I, I do wanna spend some time on it. And um, who knows, maybe uh, do a little bit of testing for the guys and, and figure some things out. Like, I definitely think my bike right now is handling really well. Um, so maybe I can bring some of that to the 450 and uh, help them guys out a little bit. Uh, yeah, no, I'm stoked. Like, I get to uh, go home, I think it's six weeks now. Uh, recover a bit because I'm, I'm hurting right now and then uh, yeah get back to it.